Hello, hello everyone, welcome back. So I have a tiny Dollar Tree haul, guys, and I found some really, really good items. So <clears throat> let's get started. So the first thing I picked up were these um, One Blade, uh, they're the Bix uh, Sensitive Racers, and you get four of them for $1.25. Everything in this haul is $1.25, guys. So really cool, so I picked up some of these. And then I, I'm just gonna go random here, guys. Um, I ended up finding this. This is new. This is a period emergency kit. That's what it's called. And it's just for her. It says unexpected situations and first time period um, emergencies. So um, it says plant-based flushable wipes, plant, um, oh, wait, per beads free, dry free. And then it says no rinsing necessary spray wash. So um, that's what you get. You actually get two uh, Mistral pads, and then you get two basic flushable um, cleaning wipes, and you get one um, no rinsing necessary spray wash. So that's what you get in this little emergency kit. So I picked up that, and then I did pick up um, this the by Prier, uh antibacterial hand wipes. Be pure. Um, 50 wipes. I always pick these up, guys. These are really good. It contains plant-based fibers. So this doesn't expire in 2, 10, 25, uh, 20, 2024, uh, 20, 25. That's when it expires. So I picked up that. I always have those here in my craft room. Okay, guys. You know how everybody says code orange for Halloween? Well, code orange and black for Halloween. So I ended up finding some Pretty Woman um, fake nails and these are Halloween ones, guys. They have the little tiny gold spiders. Really, really pretty, guys. So yeah, so this is code orange and black because Halloween is popping up at the Dollar Tree now. So I found these really cute Halloween nails, as you can see. The nails are spider webs with gold and the little um, spider is gold. Really cute. So I picked up two of these. So, um, sorry guys. Yes, code orange in black for Halloween. It's already hitting the stores. So really cool. So I picked up those. Then uh, something new and uh, for Jot, Melling, um, I found coin envelopes, and these are the 3.5 inches by 6.5 inches. So these are the bigger um, coin envelopes that I found, and you get 15 pieces in here. So I picked up that, and I did find the peach um, from LA Colors, um, the boba teas, uh, no sugar, I'm sweet enough, and these are, I think, uh, lip gloss. So I picked up that. I thought that was really cool. I found one of them. That's the only thing I found. And then I did pick up some Sprite, guys, um, you know, because I was thirsty in the car. So I picked up this, and this is a 16 float ounces. So I picked up two of those just to have. Excuse me. Oh, sorry. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm allergic to something. So I picked up two of those. And then, guys, um, I don't know if I had um, picked up this before, but I found from Jot is the sale order. I don't know if I picked up one before, but I ended up picking another one. This um, it says it's two uh, part forms and it's, I think there's 50 pieces in here. So I picked up that from Jot. So that was new at my Dollar Tree. Then I did pick up um, these Shrek. They're crew link socks, uh, fits men's shoe size six to 12. So I picked up those. I thought these were really cute. So I picked up those. And then um, I did find a 20 piece from Jot, the coin envelopes. These are 3.2 inches by 4.5 inches. So these are the medium. So you got the bigger ones here and these, this medium one. And then I did find a tiny one as well. From Jot, the coin envelopes, and these are 2.24 inches by 3.5 inches. So you get all three sizes right here. Really cool little envelopes to put in your junk journals. So that's why I picked them up. 
And then I did pick up some of these uh, your reusable, um, to, you know, um, they're the Kirinota Basics Fresh Floss Picks. They're coconut, no, coco, cocoa mint flavor floss. So I picked up those, those were new, you get 60. So I picked up that. And then I did pick up Biggs. Um, this is the dill pickles, sunflower seeds. The Kusha dill spreads are roasted in the USA, that's what it says. And it doesn't expire until May 19, 2025. So it expires in a couple of days. So I didn't check the date on that. But maybe it might be gone by that time. And then I did pick up some Gerbert's milk chocolate uh, dry roasted peanuts. I always pick up these guys. So I picked up some of those. And then I did pick up the hot tamales um, flavor, the cinnamon flavor candy. So I picked up those. So I picked up that. And then, guys, this was new at my Dollar Tree. This is a handheld bug zapper. It says a thousand bolts bolts and it takes two double a batteries sewed separately but this is so cool guys and the buttons right here for you to turn it on so i guess you just like swipe it around you and the bugs get zapped <laughs> i feel bad for the bugs but you know for the mosquitoes i thought this was really cool guys i'm gonna give this a go and i'll let you know if this is worth it or not but some guys came behind me and took the whole two boxes so i only got one so yeah, so that was a bummer, but it still worked out good for me anyway. And then guys, I found this from Be Pure. This one's a coconut scented hand sanitizer spray. So I picked up that, so I thought that was really cool. And then I did find a little pin uh, hand sanitizer spray as well in the coconut, um, the coconut scent. So I thought that was really cool to find. And then I did pick up some more of the Essentials Natural Source of Baking Soda Clear Water Deodorant towel, Towels, or towels, whatever you want to call them. So I picked up some more of these. You get 30. These are really good, guys. So I picked up some of those. And then I did find some more of the Air Fryer Parchment Paper Liners. There's 20 in here in the smaller size. So I picked up two more of these. These work really, really good, guys. I, I use these all the time when I air fry stuff. So I picked up that. And then, guys, it was so exciting to find the silicone straw covers. There's six pieces in here. So you get like a little, I guess it's a, a shark or a mermaid. I don't know what that is. A little flower, um, a rainbow, a cloud, a shooting star, and I guess a star. Really, really cute, guys. So I picked up those. So I picked up two of these because I did find them. Um, so I picked up two of those. They were just on the end cap, guys. Y'all got to look at the end caps because that's where I found them. And they were actually over there um, on a lady's cart. Um, I guess she was putting up sodas and stuff, and it was hanging off of her cart. So really odd place to be at, but I found them when I passed by there. And then, guys, I went over to the children's section. And I found these. These are the historical document posters. So, yeah, guys, these are good for junk journaling. So, I'm going to open up one, see what kind of papers you get. So, I ended up picking up two. Here's the other one. So, I picked up two. And um, these are really good for junk journaling, like I said, guys. Let's see what kind of papers you get. And these are called the historical documents posters. But they don't feel like poster, guys. They feel like just regular. Oh, I think they're... Oh, it's a big poster. Oh, that is so cool. And it's double-sided, I think. Yeah. So it's a big poster. Uh, you get two of them. It's a big poster, guys. But you can cut it and use it in your junk journal. It's a big poster. Wow, that is so cool. But I got it to use it for junk journaling. That I'm gonna distress it, so you can actually cut it in this. You know, each um, fold you can cut a sheet of paper. So I thought that would be really cool for junk journaling. So you get two of them, and you can cut up quite a few in there. So yeah, I picked up two of those. 
really cool so that is everything from my dollar tree guys if you like my videos thumb them up leave me a comment if you wish and subscribe and have a wonderful day bye